What's up guys, Ian Golden with DJ Tech Tools here. Uh, I'm actually here in the uh, Thud Rumble Hubert Scratch University yep. layer, also known as the Octagon. Uh, and I'm here with the man, D Styles, and we're gonna ask each of these guys uh, about their practice routine. So the first question is, um, how do you practice? How do you perfect your timing? Um, you know, when I practice, I, I just try to run through everything I know I, in, in no particular order. I just, just try to let it all out, you know. Um, <laughs> do you do any uh, timing exercises with a click track or anything like that? Do you go through uh, 16th notes or no. quarter notes? What I try to do is just scratch to, to different tempos. So what I'll do is I'll do a slow 65 BPM. Okay. And then I'll jump to a mid 90 and then, then go to like a 130 type beat. And you do the same scratch at each tempo, uh, getting faster and faster. Pretty practice. much, yeah. Certain beats kind of dictate your, your flow. And yeah. so I, I, I just kind of try to play with the beat. <laughs> So, Cuber uh, told me one of the things he uses uh, is he tries to emulate a lot of rappers' uh, flows in terms of finding different voicings. Yeah. And I, I agree, I think that's really powerful. Yeah. So, I was hoping maybe you could share with us one really cool phrase or voicing that you think is very unique to yourself. Yeah. That maybe the, the listeners and the watchers can try to duplicate themselves. Okay. Um, you know, I, I, I listen to a lot of uh, like Cool Keith. Uh, Dr. Octagon and in, in, in some of his uh, flows, he he does some real uh, simple stuff. It's like a a fickety fit, I like a fickety foo, I think a fickety feet, and so it's all like a. Just kind of like that, and um, yeah, I mean, you, whatever you can you can uh, you can kind of come up with with your mouth, you can try to say with with the turntable. <laughs> All right, so next up we've got the man, Mr. Shortcut. I don't Another mem member of the uh, infamous and very famous Scratch Pickles. Mm -hmm. So how do you practice? What's your regular routine to develop your timing? Um, as far as practice, I'll probably look, I mean, really I listen to other DJs. All in the head now too, you know, when you listen to it. Just kind of, you know, how people air guitar, I guess, but for me it's, like, it's more of like, just trying to figure out like patterns in your head. So you visualize a lot with your head and you yeah. kind of let your hands follow. Yeah. Right. Like, so the thing that I'll remember, like, you know, um, he said his too, like, you know, listen up to MCs. For me, I'll listen to a lot of, like, uh, a lot of dance hall artists. Okay. Kind of chat that way, but they have different patterns, and, you know what I mean? Cool. So I'll listen to the way they rhyme and do their thing, and I'll think like that as well. <laughs> So we're here uh, again with Qbert, uh, and the three of these guys are going to be playing at Fader Fest in San Francisco. And like we asked the other guys, we're just wondering, is there a phrase that you've been working on that you want to show us that guys can try to duplicate themselves at home? Um, yeah, sure. Basically, um, the rapper I copy is myself. Yo, I'm chilling. Everybody's illin'. Hey, hey, no, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> Let's see here. I saw we copy the, uh, the rapper, um, is that the Good Times? No, not Good Times, though. Rappers, rappers Delight. It's gonna be like, the hip, hop, a hit me to the beat, they don't stop the rocking, bang, bang. And so on and so forth, so. Well, That's right, you guessed it. Easy Q is back. <laughs> <laughs>